need to spend my life in a gym. I've got a bow flex. It all started for Pamela Davis with a piece of exercise equipment. Our gym was closed, so we went on Amazon. We had gone to a couple retailers. We couldn't find a bow flex, so we went on Amazon. Even though it was back ordered, by July 24th, online tracking said Davis's bow flex was out for delivery to her Modesto home. So we were excited. We cleaned up the room that it was going in, and we were waiting with faded breath and it didn't show up. After six days with no delivery, she came here to the series UPS processing center. They asked for the tracking number and then he looked it up and he said, oh, it's in the pile. You need to go look in the pile. The pile is this, a pile of packages sitting in the customer parking lot. Davis gave KCRA 3 her tracking number to check on her shipment, and what we found was hundreds of packages strewn across the lot. And there was a gentleman out by the pile, and he told us that this pile was everything that hadn't been delivered, and this pile was huge. I'm five foot tall and it was taller than me and it's probably at that point 100 by 100 uh, feet uh, wide and long. Packages had been sitting here so long they were sun bleached, the labels nearly illegible. Another customer who did not want to go on camera told us they've been waiting for this package, a mattress, since the 30th. And the pile was far smaller when we were there. My husband and I were talking about it later going, you know, we feel, you know, it's bad enough that we're waiting for something, but there's hundreds of people still waiting for stuff and there's no rhyme or reason. When checking for Davis's Bowflex, an employee inside the facility told us UPS currently has more shipments now than during the holiday rush. He also claimed there were 15 people out with COVID-19 exposure and others on vacation. UPS corporate sent a statement saying they are treating every package delivered as if it's our only one. We are seeing unprecedented holiday volume during the pandemic, and our employees at the UPS Series Operations Center have worked over the weekend to meet this demand. A demand that Pamela Davis still wishes had been met. Her Bowflex hasn't arrived. We were exposed on Sunday to somebody who possibly has COVID. So now we are locked in our rooms with nowhere to go, we can't even go for a walk, and we don't have a bow flex.